Operation Plan Number 16. Welcome back to another Bit Legend video, boys. If you don't know Gosler Croc, have you even been following the show? So he has a 1SP attack target. He's got a 1SP heal team skill, which is very, very undervalued. Uh, not undervalued with ED, but it's just the, the percentage on it's a lot lower than it should be. Um, enemy team gets 5% diversion. That could be a problem. Hopefully it won't be, but it probably will. Um, enemy damage taken, minus 15%. Not the worst thing in the world. Ally attack damage, minus 30%. So essentially we're doing somewhere around minus 45% damage, which that is quite significant. And then up here during the battle, um, the damage to an enemy is reduced by 75% for the first attack. We know how to deal with that. I'll talk about it because you've seen it before. And when the battle starts, we're going to lose one pip of SP. <clears throat> so to take away the damage reduction thing, we're going to use a final mech like I always do. He is going to do a 1 SP attack all, and then that's going to be gone, and then you're going to proceed as normal. But this is Gossip Croc that we're fighting, so 1 SP heal all. The percentage on this, I think it's a typo. It's got to be like, this is supposed to be like 60% to like 108% or something like that. 15 to 45, there's, there's no way that's not a typo. But I guess that might work in our advantage. When I use this guy, I use him for the snipe skill, so I'm not worried about it. And his heals, sometimes it's better than nothing, but usually Pioneers is, is going to have to carry over here. Whew, let us get into it. Autopilot is on like it always is, and we're paying for it. But that's fine. We're probably going to have to punch these guys anyways. Don't know what they do, don't care. Let's get healthy, and let's do it. Um, I don't have any SP yet, so I can't use my 1 SP attack all skill. But we're gonna get there. We'll get there, boys. We'll get there. Oh, I'm still pumped, man. If you guys saw the Hades episode, I filmed that right before this. And oh my goodness. Um, well, there's that deflect we talked about. The Hades episode. Holy smokes. Um, I was pumped. That that honestly had to be the most epic battle you have ever seen in this entire genre of gaming. Um, I don't care where you're coming from, I don't care where you're going. That was some epic stuff right there. And the deflect again, but the healing pets polishes it off, no problem. I feel really good about that. Okay, moving on. Moving on. I don't know who this guy is in front of me. He looks really cool. He looks really cool, but that's not what we're here for. We're not, I'm not here to take, in the, to take in the sights. I'm here to try to get, uh, get to some bosses, and I don't know where to go. I think it's going to be down there and to the left. Could it be up top? Have I already forgotten who I'm supposed to be fighting? I kind of want to wait for him to turn around, but I also kind of want to fight him and see what the heck he does. But here, let's go, 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 go. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Let's continue. Now we have some SP, so we're going to use the 1 SP attack all. Um, interesting that they're attacking before my final mech is. So that's a, that's a speedy boy over there. But there you go. This does no damage. I wonder if the reflect counts. Since the furthest enemy um, reflected, I think he's PD001 or whatever, um, does that mean that the damage direction thing is gone? So it's to try to hit him. That was low damage. So I think that maybe if he reflects like he did, it doesn't count for removing the 75% damage reduction. You guys get what I'm saying, hopefully. But whatever, not a big deal. Let's try to get healthy and let's try to get out of here. Let's try to uh, punch some stuff. Ooh, that's not what I wanted. Let's do a little switch for a minute. Actually, let's do it. I don't want him to get sniped out of the back. That's gonna be a pain in my butt. Their SP is full, so I suppose that I should have used a heal there, but the heal is just so low. Let's use this one. He's healthy, but my Pioneer has no SP, so <clears throat> we will be mindful of that. No one be there. All right, boys. We're trying to get through this trash. We're trying to get through so we can get out of here. Bang. All right. So the deflex, a little bit scary. Because we do have deflex and 
other stuff. Yeah, our damage is very, very much reduced. There is an SP Shrine there. I like it, but I want to see... Oh, let's do it. SP Shrine right there. Boss right there. Couldn't be better. We're healthy. No potions used, right? I believe. No potions. Yeah. Okay. I like it. So, the boss can hit hard. I am going to try to take him out, but I'm going to do the 1 SP attack all. Let's take off the 75% damage reduction. And let us proceed like normal. So, 2 SP attack rear. I'm finding that these bosses are like always in the rear. So, if you want to stack a lot of attack furthest, um, you might have a really good time with that. But let's continue. Boom. He's got a Gossip Crocs at a little bit more SP than I would like. Um, I don't think there's team damage here, but I might be sorely mistaken. So, I'm going to use Pioneers. Um, SP on snipe as well. That's Gossler Croc um, doing his heal team. Not the worst thing in the world. And let's keep going. Though. Attack target. That was a nice strike. That's why I bring you, Moon Moon. That's why I bring you. Attack target. That's why I bring you. Oh, look at that beautiful heal. It's the weakest pet. Doing work. So close. Can we get him out? I'm going to save his SP. I'm going to save Pioneer's SP in case uh, some silliness happens. But I think the Croc... It would be. It kind of would have been funny if um, Gossler Croc killed Gossler Croc. I feel like that should have given me style points. But whatever. And attack. Target. Autopilot. Autopilot, yeah, okay, let's not autopilot too much. There is, um, there is deflect and other silly things here. Let's kill that fish. I think the fish is a problem. And I would like to get some healing out eventually. I still don't know what that guy, the blue guy with the red horn coming out of his nose, uh, what he does, but he looks cool. I like the art in this game. When I first started playing, it took me a second to kind of get used to things that are different. I really don't like the waifu art. So it's definitely apparent to me that there's different artists working on this material, but... Um, I like it, man. It's grown on me. The further you get in the content, the better art that you run into. Um, things just get better and better. But there you go, fellas. Pretty straightforward. That could have been a really scary combination of different things. All the debuffs and whatnot. But I'm feeling good about life. We have just cleared through another boss and we're going to collect 600 elimination currency. So if you're probably sitting, if you get to, if you're like, I don't know, if you're in zone one through zone eight, um, when I was doing that, I was able to clear through hell mode. But as soon as I got to zone nine, uh, the bosses jumped up significantly in uh, difficulty and I had to start thinking about it. And so what I chose to do and what I suggest for you guys to do, if you can't clear hell mode like this, you should just save your elimination tickets or at least consider saving it. You know, if you're super close and you're like, oh, but I only need 40 mountain guts or mountain materials and I can get my upgrade. Okay, yeah, go for it. No big deal. Same thing with your talents. But if you are, if nothing's urgent and you're just chilling and it's not going to make a big deal, I would say wait because I saved up 30 tickets. So that is going to be 3K points, which is around 100 mount materials and managing your stuff is the name of the game. So, I'm feeling good about it. Plus, also, I mean, it's, there's nothing hurting you for waiting, and it just feels good. It feels bad to just do hard mode. You're only getting 500 out of 600 points, and then you reset it, and you just you get that little feeling. You're just like, oh, man, I hate waste. I hate waste and stuff. But it feels good. So I'm gonna continue posting these elimination videos. Some of them are just down to the wire and they're really entertaining. And I think it's um, the best battles that I've had in this game type um, period. And it's, I'm having a lot of fun with it. It's making me take a look at my team. It's making me take a look at my gear. But if you were smart with your team, like the team that I built is pretty much useful in all content. You know, one SP attack target's always gonna be good. Having a healer or two available is always gonna be good. And uh, we're, we're making things happen. But there you go. Let's collect some loot, call it a day, and I'll start filming the next one. Look at all that, just money. I'll show you how much I have farmed so far. When I started filming this, I had like 27 or so. Um, 27 or so, now we're down to 10. So now we, we had 30. So we, we've done 20 of these, let's look at the shop. And 11.2K. Making that money. As always, I appreciate you guys for watching. 
and I will see you in the next video.